He was in the hospital earlier this week, but tonight he's back on the sideline. Local legend James Radio Kennedy back in action, leading the TL Hanna Yellow Jackets on the field. And we were there as Radio made his appearance along with former TL Hanna head coach Harold Jones. Fox Carolina's Brooklyn Cromer joins us live now from TL Hanna with that report. Corey, these two have been attending the games together for years, up until this season when radio has recently had some health issues. But tonight he was in good spirits. He was here leading the team on the field. It was definitely a special night for them both and for everyone here in the crowd. On Friday nights for the last 55 years, they've been inseparable. When I was coaching, he was right there. You know, he started coming when I was coaching JV football and that was in 1964 when he showed up. In 1970 then he came out to the start of the high school. Now more than 50 years later coach Harold Jones and James Radio Kennedy still watch the Yellow Jackets every chance they get. When he used to he'd run out with him and bust the battle you know but over the years you know he'd stay the whole game then he got to where about halftime he'd come up there with us and then he got shorter and shorter, you know. Radio had surgery earlier this week and had a port installed for kidney dialysis. I went to the house pill. I had surgery on my arm. How are you feeling? I feel good. Though he's battling some health issues, the smile never leaves his face. And tonight, he's in good spirits at his favorite place, leading the Yellow Jackets on the field. We're going to win the ball game. As the years pass by, some things remain the same a friendship for the books, and a love for T.L. Hanna football. I tell you, he's just Mr. T.L. Hanna. That's what it is, you know. Well, radio is feeling better, and he's set to start dialysis this coming week. And of course, we all wish him a speedy recovery so he can be back cheering on the Yellow Jackets full-time. Live in Anderson, Brooklyn Cromer, Fox Carolina, the 10 o'clock news. Looked like he was having a great time.